It is wonderful to be able to eat good food again. These snails are so plump, so juicy. You know that the Northmen have not all left. The great warrior called Rollo has remained in the camp. But most have gone. Yes, but they will return again. That is why Rollo has remained. They will return in the spring, probably in even greater numbers. Surely one of your brothers will come to our aid. I have been weak enough to send messages to them. I have begged and pleaded our cause to no avail. Their hatred for me turns out to be the supreme and guiding principle of their lives. So what are we to do? I will not be known to history as the French emperor who presided over the destruction of Paris. I cannot and will not allow such an intolerable fate to befall a beloved city. You will have to offer them even more money. <laughs> I will have to offer them even more than that. I must offer them something far more precious to me than gold or silver. I must offer your hand in marriage. This is Count Odo's doing. Just because I refuse to marry him, he wants to have me thrown to the dogs. Will you not consider it, my child, for the sake of Paris? I would do almost anything for the sake of Paris. I would kill myself for the sake of Paris. But I will not be tied in holy matrimony to someone who is more beast than man. Then I will have to recall her deputation. You have already sent an envoy to make this offer? Without even asking me? Without even thinking of me? Oh, father. I am your father. But I am also the Emperor of Francia. And it is not your father who asks this of you. It is the Emperor. And therefore, you will obey him. <laughs> 